uh, antisocial behavior uh, chicho rightism is the belief that there is an underlying hierarchy that allows for value discriminant and that the existence of the hierarchy is good leftism believes that a value hierarchy creates a group who are unable to climb the ladder unchecked rightism leads to tyranny of those at the top of the hierarchy over those at the bottom unchecked leftism leads to the destruction of the hierarchy and therefore we lose the ability to make value decisions uh, uh i disagree to a certain degree uh, because leftism can lead to tyranny we've already seen it we're seeing it right now in canada and other parts of europe right leftism has full-on tyranny full-on tyranny tyranny to the level that uh certain fascists throughout history would have only dreamt of being able to do such as such as seizing the bank accounts of those that are being charged with mischief seizing the bank accounts of those that haven't been charged with anything seizing the bank accounts for those who are making a donation to a cause seizing the bank accounts of single mothers working minimum wage that are trying to support organizations that want to open the economy so they can get out of poverty and the government the left government seizing those um, those people's bank accounts at the same time citizens of that nation whose bank accounts have not been seized putting their fingers up their thumb and saying that's the right thing to do right leftism can lead to tyranny like nothing else and it leads to it extremely fast i have never throughout history and i like studying history right i've studied history many uh, and watched uh, social economic development i have never in my life okay read about a situation where rightism was able to acquire this much power without the population rising up in a way that they shat their pants right i have never witnessed it happen this quickly right and is there economically is it they're they're literally in canada they are killing the economy they are devastating the economy why are they devastating it because they want the majority of the population to be dependent on the state right because if they step out of line they don't get the money they don't get the money they don't get the food they don't get the food they don't get to eat they don't get to eat they don't they don't get to live right so they better bend the knee